Here's another edition of Animal Planet News. Australian developers are on the move, building homes in serene eucalyptus forests and shopping areas that serve some residents but terrify others. Urbanization has destroyed an alarming 80% of the natural habitat of one of the world's most popular animals, the koala. You know what really surprised me and really saddened me is on how many areas that we've gone into where we expected to see koalas and they're already gone. With help from the San Diego Zoo, Australian scientists are involved in a massive high-tech undertaking to save the endangered koalas by saving the trees they live in. But it starts with down and dirty field work in steaming, tick-infested forests. They tag every single tree that shows evidence that koalas were there, evidence like fecal pellets or claw marks. This side of the tree, or this particular part of the tree, is pulled by the sharp claws of the animal time and time again as it's visited this tree. Well, this is a very important tree for the koala that owns this piece of country. The location of every single tree, along with data such as soil type and elevation, is fed into a computer to create something called the Koala Habitat Atlas. The light green areas are scattered vegetation, the mid green is medium vegetation. The Koala Habitat Atlas is the most extensive mapping ever done to save an animal species. It will show government and developers how to spare the koalas and their forest homes. The hope is that this high-tech atlas will help preserve the koala through dark times and promise a much brighter tomorrow. And that's Animal Planet News.